my introductory remarks, I'd like to talk a little bit about some of the latest research I was reviewing in preparation to come this morning. And uh, one of the types of surgery that you are probably well aware of uh, that you can have for weight loss is something called the Roux-en-Y gastric bypass. And uh, you looked into that, the Roux-en-Y gastric bypass? I just went to a seminar that covered that and the left band. And the left band, good. Roux-en-Y gastric bypass? My brother has it. Good. And doing okay? Mm -hmm. Good. All right. But you didn't elect to have it? Mm -hmm. No. Because? Because this one is revisable and the time of the under anesthesia is less. And so hopefully we'll have lower complication rate and things like that. And that's what we're going to kind of talk about this morning. You looked into the room and why you know what it is a little bit? Yes. But, but this, the, the, the uh, again, the, the time under surgery, uh, recovery time, and then the, the five-year results. And we're going to talk about some of the results recently reported on the Roux and Y in several studies. You looked at the Roux and Y, I thought about it a little bit? Yeah, I had a friend that had it done, actually it's like cooking. And did okay? They're doing fine. But you elected not to follow them. Yeah, I have also had two sister models that chose this one. And, and, uh, they're doing pretty well. Yeah, they're doing really well. Well, um, our concern is that we'd like to op offer the best weight loss surgery to you. And just to list them again, you may have heard of, I think we just said, left band, Roux and Y gastric bypass can be done with the big incision, the open gastric bypass, the laparoscopic Roux and Y gastric bypass. There's something uh, you might have heard of, the bilio pancreatic diversion with duodenal switch. No. Well, that's one that's out there. It's a really major surgery. They, they bypass almost all of the small intestine. They cut out 90% of the stomach and actually take it out and throw it away. One of the hot new topics is a type of surgery called the sleeve gastrectomy. And the sleeve gastrectomy, they actually cut the stomach a lot like we do for the mini gastric bypass, but they cut the entire outside edge and then cut it out and throw it away. And uh, it gets moderate weight loss. It doesn't have some of the risks of the other bigger surgeries but the weight loss is kind of just medium, so it depends on your situation. Um, recent articles have talked about the laparoscopic Roux and Y gastric bypass, and I thought I'd look at those briefly with you this morning. Um, one is that the state of Washington published a series of every single person in the state who'd had laparoscopic Roux and Y gastric bypass, and they found two out of every hundred died within 30 days. Another recent study from the National Institutes of Health looked at complications after a Roux and Y gastric bypass and found that 40% of patients in the first year had a complication. Almost half. The next study that I looked at this morning looked at rehospitalization. So you could have a complication, but maybe you don't have to go to the hospital for it. And they found that in the first year and the second year and the third year, in the state of California, where they analyzed all gastric bypasses done in the state of California, 20% of people were back in the hospital with complications on the first year and the second year, and it dropped slightly to 18% in the third year. And then a study from New Jersey looked at 3,000 gastric bypasses that were done by a group of surgeons there, and they found 10% one in ten had a surgery in the first year for bowel obstruction because the bowel gets twisted or kinked. And then finally a study of uh, ten centers that did laparoscopic gastric bypass just reported a two percent rate of leaks, abscess infection right after surgery. So that's why we're not doing a laparoscopic root and wide gastric bypass this morning. That's kind of a track record from top to bottom, beginning to end, of pretty bad results. And our results are in 